too. Guess what I'm Turn left onto North Chestnut Street. Then your destination will be on the right. I'm going to the Forsyth County Government Center building. And I'm about to start a big business. Thank you. Thank you. No. I can't believe I actually did this. It's super easy. So You're it's done. like official. You're done. What I, I gotta I, do next though? I think one of them might have to stamp it, but it's done. Or she might be able to do everything. I think when I did I had to go down to like two stations. <sighs> okay. Let me take a breather for a moment because I just started a business. I <laughs> just started a business. <sighs> and it was so easy. I paid my Forsyth County, North Carolina fee. I filled out this form. So my name, my business name is registered. Nobody else can take my name or use my name. That feels amazing. And my friend E came along with me. He's a business owner as well. He owns his own lawn care company. He does my lawn and a lot of other lawns. And he's really good. Nobody else touches my yard. But he came with me and he walked with me through the process. And I am a business owner now. So next things I need to do, which I'll probably do it tomorrow, is open up a business bank account. I'm going to go ahead and see about getting a logo and all that stuff made. And then I'm going to see about getting me some shirts made that I can wear for my little, I guess, quote-unquote uniform. <laughs> Ew! That's what I'm about to do. And uh, I guess the only person I'm probably tell right now is my brother because he's also been helping me for this process. Like my brother is very business savvy. He knows a lot about a lot, especially when it comes to businesses and stuff like that. So I'm gonna reach out to him. I'm gonna actually send him a picture of this and be like, "Blow, ta -da! Watch out now. <laughs> but I'm about to do that. And since I'm off of work for the rest of the day, go get me something to eat. I'm going to go figure out my next plan and my next move. I really thought it was so much more to this that I was going to have to do. And that's what I kind of planned on. But, wow. Wow. Okay. Yo, I got to tell you something. Come in. Just, just a little bit closer. Come, come, come. You're looking at a business owner. Y'all, so, let me tell y'all, it is so good to have really good, genuine friends in your life. So, my registration fee to register my business name, my friend took care of that for me. Then let me tell you, and I'm sharing this because it really just blows my mind, even still, like I've known him since we were 19 years old, but it still just blows my mind and how he thinks of things. So the change that, was given back to me after purchasing my uh, registration fee. I gave it to him and he gave it right back to me. And he was like, no, nah, you keep that. And I was like, no, no, I was like, this was yours, thank you, da, da, da. He was like, no, he's like, now, now you go. And it's just crazy because like, <laughs> it makes perfect sense. So let me tell y'all what the name of the business is gonna be. that don't fit me that fits me perfectly bro we coming out the mud like they say like we are coming out the mud with this one but i'm gonna make it happen i'm so excited i'm very nervous but i done prayed on this i prayed about this thing and i mean hard hard and i asked you know i normally would ask for a clear-cut sign you know how you do that you're praying in the lord please give me a clear sign let me know what it is please you know just answer me in a way that I understand I said all oh, anything you think of I said it I didn't do that this time though I just prayed and I talked to him like I normally would and I was just like Lord
Lord, if you think this is something that I need to move forward with, I need to go ahead and pursue. This is the right time for it. This is the right business you want me to start with. Because again, this is not like my overall dream. I have something else in mind. But you got to start with something to help build your overall dream, if you feel what I mean. So, I said, Lord, if this is the right avenue for me, if this is what you want me to do right now, if this, if this is the step I need to take to get where I'm trying to get to, then let it happen. Let it be for me. Let me know. And sure enough, I looked to my right, and I seen now, and this is why this is so much of a sign to me, because I take the same exact route every morning going to work every single day and some Saturdays so I'm driving to work it's regular traffic or whatever everybody's in a rush to get absolutely nowhere except work but everybody's driving I'm not really paying attention to the people around me now there's this car this brightly colored car and again I'm not paying any attention because I'm driving and I'm praying I'm talking to the Lord so I'm not paying any attention but this car is been riding next to me and I know it has because I, out from my peripheral, I can see that it's a brightly colored car. I don't know what color, I just know it's bright. And I know it's been there for a while. So I'm riding, 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 praying, 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 praying talking, 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 asking, asking, all this stuff. And I say, you know, just let me know. Just let this be for me, let me know. I happen to glance over to my right. You know, one of them, like, you just driving. You just finish praying, turn the music back up, you just... And when I look, I'm like, bruh, there is no clearer sign than the one that was there. There was this brightly colored, it's like a pink or purple, fuchsia, somewhere in there, colored car. And it said, either on the side of it. In the biggest letters I've ever seen, the car was a bright color, the letters were a bright color. So it was like right there, and like I told you, that car had been riding next to me for the longest, but I never once looked at it because I'm focusing on my prayer and I'm focusing on the road. And when I happened to glance over, it was right. And it seemed like as soon as I glanced over and looked at her car, and then I looked at her, she she pulled on up and she was like gone. And I'm like, okay, okay, Lord, pause. Let me let me call my mama real quick because that's my go-to. Let me call my mama real quick just to see if you know she would have thought this was a sign. Also, you know, because I don't want to overreact. I, I can be a little dramatic, especially when I'm excited. So let me just call her and get her opinion. I told her everything from start to finish, and she was like, "Yeah, I would take that as a sign too." Like that, it really doesn't get any clearer than that. And I was like, "And that's what I'm gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. I've been putting aside money. One of the businesses I was interested in starting." But I've had so many different ideas and so many different things I want to do. So I was just saving the money to save it for anything that, you know, I was just like, okay, this is it. I wanted to be able to jump in and start and do something. So this is it. Better. So I'm on my way right now to Walmart, which I really didn't want to go, to be honest, because of all this COVID-19 stuff. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Okay, so I'm on my way to work. It's a Friday morning. I wanted to take a moment and actually share something with you. So I told um, my brother and my mom yesterday about the business or whatever. And I guess, you know, Zaya was around, but she didn't really, she wasn't really listening. Or I guess she didn't understand it. So this morning while I was praying, my daily prayer, <laughs> Um, she was in the car while I was getting ready to drop her off. And I said, Lord, I thank you for allowing me to take steps into this venture and become a business owner. And she said, oh, you're a business owner? <laughs> and it was just like the innocence. <laughs> the innocence in her voice was like so sweet. And I was like, well, yeah, you know, yes, I, I am. I'm a business owner now. She's like, do you have any employees? I was like, no, not yet. She's like, I want to be your first employee. I thought that was so sweet. You know what? Y'all couldn't, y'all couldn't pay me to train my kids in. I swear. But um, 
so yeah I told her that this morning she was super excited I really don't even think she knows what it what it is that I'm doing or what the business is she just knows that <laughs> I started a business so I'm the boss and then she wants to be my first employee she is so sweet so um anyway I'm feeling good this morning on my way to work I got some things to look up research I got a purpose now I got one thing checked off of my list so that's always good um, but yeah we're just we're just taking the steps into this whole business life we're gonna see how this goes <laughs> I feel really confident about it I know as of right now with the coronavirus COVID-19 and everything going on nobody's really trying to get any additional services or extra services nobody's trying to allow anybody in their homes or even really leave their homes unless they have to um, so I'm not really expecting anything to happen right now, but this is perfect timing for me because at least I'm able to be out of work if I need to, and I'm able to, um, take the time to focus on getting everything together before the world kind of goes back to being semi-normal, which we don't really know what the new normal is going to be after this. I actually have somebody working on the logo for me, and I think it should be done sometime today. I'm so excited about that. And uh, I just got to get the insurance, be bonded and insured, so I'm not tearing up people's stuff, or if I do tear it up, I'm not responsible. My insurance cover it. And, you know, we're going to make it do what it do, baby. You know, and I'm just, I'm so excited. <laughs> and then the good thing about it is, my mama was excited too and it's like my mom has had ideas of her own or whatever but she just hasn't I guess had that extra push to try to do anything with it like kind of lit a fire in her I believe because she got so excited talking about her own idea that she had and, and she already got a logo and everything planned out and I was like mine you should definitely do it because I like it it's a good idea the logo is a good idea as well but anyway I'm pulling up at the job now I hope you all have a wonderful day stay positive stay clean stay blessed and um we're gonna make it through this i pray over all of your loved ones their health and their strength especially through this and we'll talk later all right you guys so i just wanted to touch base and again i'm sorry for all the movement i'm just getting off of work just getting off of work this is saturday Saturday. Went by pretty quick. Um, didn't have any hiccups or anything. No issues. No irate people. I really didn't even talk to no more than like two people, but you know, did a lot of everything else we do. Um, but, yeah, so today was a good day, but I wanted to touch base with you guys because I don't think I've updated you since I told you all that I had started a business and told my daughter and so on and so forth. Um, so what has happened is I've actually received my logos. I had gone on an app, I don't know if anybody's ever heard of it, but um, I think I say it wrong. My brother told me about it. He's very, very business savvy. But uh, Fiverr, I think that's what it's called. But anyway, I went to that site, and I'll actually link it down in the description box. I went to that app, downloaded that app, and it, had, it gets you in touch with a lot of um, things you may need like a lot of graphic designers a lot of <laughs> um, it gets you in touch with like a lot of graphic designers it gets you in touch with a lot of uh, people who provide a service that you may need I haven't even really gone through all of it but I know I saw graphic design because I've done before so um I found this girl on there. I think she was like from Singapore or something like that. But I found her on there and you can go through and sample some of their designs they've done. They have different price ranges and things. I spent no more than $20 on the design and I absolutely love it. So, um, I'm, I'm very, it, it was quick too. That's another thing. The turnaround time was a day. It, I could have gotten, if I wanted something more detailed or more, um, uh, intricate and all that fancy and all that stuff I would have it would have taken a little bit longer but like I said I just wanted something simple you 
know, um, like I said, startup, I'm not trying to put out a whole lot of money. My whole point in this is to provide a service and to bring money into, you know, my home, my business. So yeah, it turned out really cute. I can't wait to show you all. I showed Zaya, she loved it immediately. Everybody else I've shown it to, they was like, yeah, that's dope. I was like, I thought it was She did so good. It gives you the option also on that app to give them a tip if you would like to, depending on their service. Her turnaround time was quick. It was within a day. They give you the chat option. You can talk to and communicate with um, the people working on whatever you need them to work on for you. Um, they, with what I did, it she offered unlimited revisions. So if she sent me a few different samples, and if I didn't like any of them that she sent me, I could tell her what I don't like, what I want to change, what I want her to add, or anything, and she would revise it as much as possible. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm very satisfied. I definitely will be using that app again. Hope. Um, so what she gave me was, I get the source file and I get the vector file. From what I was told, the vector file is what allows me to take my logo, my logo, because it belongs to me, um, have all the rights, copyrights, all that stuff to it. It belongs to me. And I get to take that anywhere to t-shirt shops, to, um, um, what do they call it? You got your card, okay? Business cards to get those made and to get that logo printed on there. I get, I got all of that so that I can do that. Um, so I mean, it's it's pretty legit. It's I, I'm very very glad I did it. I love the way it turned out. And I can't wait to show y'all. But anyway, so far so good. Only thing left for me to do as far as this business is to get the insurance, which I did look that up as well. Like I've been so on it. I looked it up, um, looked up insurance, and I actually think I'm going to go with this company, which it'll be no more than, I think it's like $44 a month, and they will cover me, uh, I can't tell you the amounts, I don't remember the amounts, but everything was good, everything was decent, it covers me, it covers damage to my any of my property and my equipment, it covers damage to anybody else's apart, um, equipment or their home, their items and things, they're covered, so you guys can trust me in your home because I'm insured I'm insured it I'm already in the process I've already y'all look how your girl been working look how God been working hold on cops I have already uh, lined up I don't want to say clientele because you know you got to see how you first how it goes the first time and they have to determine if they want to keep you but I have a few um, people who have already mentioned me and are going to put in a good word for me for um, families that have elderly people who that I have a co-worker <laughs> she's already said she wants me to come oh I, I'm out here working you know I mean I'm, I'm on the low but I'm working out here I'm really trying I just want to give you an update as far as everything is going on with this business venture so excited so excited to throw my little Kevin Hart in there. <laughs> but um, anyway, I will touch base with you guys another time. We focus on this road, all these cops I'm seeing, you know. I don't want to become a statistic. But anyway, I love you guys. I wish you guys the absolute best. Stay positive, stay clean, stay safe. And until next time, be good morning. So guess what I wanted to tell you guys and show you guys? Zaya, what do I need to tell them? What are we officially? We're business owners. We are business owners. Yes. Mama. Okay, I'm bad. But, but, we just opened our business account. Whoop, whoop. Jeff, what is he doing? <laughs> yeah, so we just opened my business checking and business savings account got my first deposit into the business checking and business savings account and all of our good old paperwork here yeah yeah so uh we are we're getting there we're getting there last thing i need to do is um ooh, that printer was leaking some ink wasn't it yep last thing i need to do is get the business insurance but we are on the right path so far so Coronavirus, when you, you over and done with, we coming for you.
good. Jack. Jack. It's good. <laughs> you see how this little person right here single handedly trashes my house? Yes, you. Yes, you, Jack. Yeah. yeah. We got another box. Uh, 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 uh. It's what I'm very excited about. Appointment book. And it's purple. <laughs> While Jack climbs in the background. Yes. <gasps> yeah. Things are coming together so well. According to Amazon, I should have everything I need. I should have the bulk of my things coming Wednesday, which today is a Monday. So I should have the bulk of my things coming Wednesday. And then, yes, and then I have a few things that are straggling in around uh, the 5th of May. But nothing past that, so. <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so I just wanted to come to you all and let you know I got not the last but I'm waiting on one just one more thing which is was supposed to come in this shipment right here but evidently it's it's still out there it's in transit it's so freaking good um so I have basically the last of my things I was waiting on to actually start this business just came in the mail today Jackson is over here like <sighs> like I told y'all he just by himself he just take down the whole place it don't matter what I do just I'm just I'm gonna just if y'all just a little a sneakity peek these this is part of my shirt my uniform I guess you could say for the business this is another one. <laughs> so excited. I just wanted to see how it would look in white as a background and black as a background, but I kind of really like the black, but the white pops more. And these are my business cards. Those are my business cards. Got a lot of those. Watch out. Um, so in this package, I got my business cards, I got my shirts, and then my magnets that are going to go on the side of the car. They are in transit. And I also got these today. <sighs> Amazon Prime. 